The San Francisco 49ers raising some eyebrows after awarding Colin Kaepernick with a highly prestigious award for his inspirational and courageous play. But you might remember, Kaepernick is the quarterback who gained national attention for taking a knee during the national anthem. He says it's his way of protesting police brutality. One reader commenting, quote, the 49ers should visit the Vietnam Memorial, World War II Memorial, or Arlington Cemetery before they go giving an award to a real loser like Kaepernick. It's no wonder NFL ratings are down. The league sucks. It's important to note that the players vote for the award winner each year, not team officials or the league. Joe Theismann, conveniently, you are here to respond to this. Yes, isn't that convenient? Uh, <laughs> I, I, I wouldn't use the same terminology that the uh, the one person. Yeah, used, it was hard but, for me to. But I, I just find it hard to believe you're a two and fourteen football team. He's won one football game. What has he inspired? I mean, and the players voted for it, and I. You, you, you question players at time. They just sort of move along in mass mm -hmm. um, and, and do this. I don't agree with what he's done. As a matter of fact, the American flag, and I wear one on my lapel very proudly, no matter where I go, um, it stands for the right to be able to do the things that you want to do, to be able to stand up and have a difference of opinion. And I agree with that part of it, but not when you're on the job. I would like to see the National Football League finally stand up and take a stance and say, as a part of our new policy going forward, we are going to adopt the same policy that the NBA has, mm -hmm. that you will stand for the national anthem. How do you think Roger Goodell has handled all this? I, I, well, I, I think he's been wishy-washy on it. I think you have to stand up and present it to the owners. You know, Clark Hunt, who owns the Kansas City Chiefs, made it very, very clear, you will stand. No, if you're in the organization, if you're on the team, if you're on the coaching staff, and if you don't, you will be gone, period. Nice, simple statement. And I think that the National Football League has to take a stance. It's about the veterans. It's about, it's about the veteran memorial. It's about the, those that have fought and served and died. It's about the police officers that defend our lives. Mm -hmm. it, it's more than just an individual. This award doesn't mean anything courageous, to me. Courageous. Courageous, in, inspired and courageous. You're 2-14. and 14. What did he inspire? He's 1 in 11 as a quarterback. What do you possibly inspire? Well, he has a lot of free time at 1 in 11. He'll have a lot more, I think, coming <laughs> yeah. up. I mean, first string might be just a suggestion for him. But if he's taking a knee and he had said, I'm praying for our veterans. If he had supplanted whatever action it was with something more positive, would it have mattered? I, uh, probably not as it has. Mm -hmm. uh, one of the issues I had a problem with was the socks that he has worn, oh, depicting, yeah. Before, uh, yeah. Yeah. depicting a pig's head with an officer's hat on. I have a real problem with that yeah. as well. And like I said, everybody has the right to express their opinion, but not in the workplace. But Joe, I well, pay you to do a job. I pay you to do a job. I mean, in the way that you paint the picture, and I totally agree with a lot of these ideas, it, it, the responsibility kind of goes back to the owners. I mean, because this is a business after all. And is it diminishing ratings or are ratings down for another reason? I think I it's mean, part of it. I, well, I think. Look, I think, well, we I think there are different, I think there are different reasons. There are it, different reasons why ratings they? are down. I think saturation of the product is one. Mm. I don't necessarily believe that Thursday night is a night that has been what everybody's expected it to be. I think Colin Kaepernick's situation is another. I think people see an awful lot of football. I mean, look at this weekend. My well, goodness. Well, Joe Theismann, you're nothing but class, and we're well, happy sweet. you're here Thank with you. us.